one of those days. So, your favorite corporate trainer was at our McLean store teaching a couple of new hires when somehow Morris, our company's founder, snuck in and started walking around the store. Should somebody go over and help that gentleman looking at the men's shoes? What gentleman? That gentleman over there. Okay, stay put and don't talk to anyone. I'll be right back. I gotta call Garrett. Where's Garrett? Where's Garrett? Where's Garrett? Come on. Greed works. Greed clarifies. Not today, Cindy. All of this. <sighs> okay, we'll call Sean. Gotta call Sean. Hey, Cindy. How's it going with the new guys in McLean? Morris is in the store, and he looks super angry, and I can't get a hold of Garrett. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Why is Morris angry? I don't know why. This is above my pay grade, Mr. Vice President. Just get down here as soon as possible. Oh! Now, I had no idea why Morris was in the store, and that worried me. Was this about the whole thing with General Upti Frats? Okay, so what's he been up to? He keeps picking up the shoes and looking at them angrily, and then he puts them back. Yeah, I don't know why he's so mad at the shoes. I gotta tell you, I, I didn't know what to do. Oh, man. Here I thought I was walking into a minefield. And what do I see instead? Morris and Cindy chatting it up with the new guys. Sean, you and Cindy in the same store at the same time. Lucky me. Son of a gun. Forgot my glasses again, but thank God I had a pair in the back room. The man needed glasses. It was nice seeing Cindy and Sean. I missed them both since I retired. It turned out to be a great day. I wonder what Garrett's doing. Two, three, and cha-cha-one, and switch the way from foot to foot. 